Hi students, following up on our previous video about the interesting cultural ways to say yes, this video we are looking at the different cultural ways to say no. Um, again, this is not a difficult piece of English grammar or pronunciation, but I hope it's a fun, interesting, quick way for you to improve your speaking fluency to sound a little bit more like a native American English speaker. Just like we did with yes, we are going to talk about three different ways that people use to say no. The first way is by using the words, the different variety of words to say no. Things like nah, nope, no way, not at all, or never. The second way is through using adverbs. And most of the adverbs are the same as the adverbs we use for yes. We are just adding the word not after the adverb. Absolutely not. Definitely not. For sure not. And the third way is again using those sounds to show a negative. There's no actual word, although there is a written form that you will see across the bottom of the screen. The way that I might type this form in a text message or see it written in literature, in a storybook. The sound nuh uh, nuh uh, and hm mm, -mm. Mm -mm. Just to make a quick comparison between the negative sounds and the positive sounds, we hear mm hmm compared to hm mm and uh huh compared to nuh uh. You hear that the positive sounds go up and the negative sounds go down. I hope this was a good quick lesson for you. Again, not a difficult piece of English, but an interesting piece of culture for American English and a quick way that you can improve your fluency, improve the sound uh, to sound more like a native American English speaker. So the next time when you're talking with your coworker, you're talking with your landlord, your neighbor, your teacher in English class, instead of saying no, try to push yourself and say things like nope, nah, nah, -uh, definitely not. Until next time, students. Bye.